Hi. Today we are going to take a look at the Nautilus box, a filament storage solution which has been specifically designed for the Nautilus, but may be used for any 3D printer that uses 1.75 millimeter filament. So, all filament absorbs moisture from the air, which can cause printing issues, such as poor layer adhesion, bad surface texture, stringing, and sometimes jams. However, not all materials suffer from moisture absorption to the same degree. The primary culprits are nylon and copolyesters like CPE and PETG. The Nautilus box was designed to keep filament dry for longer and provide a storage solution that your Nautilus can print directly from. The Nautilus box will not actively dry your filament. This is why we recommend you also purchase a filament dryer. Most common food dehydrators will work for this purpose. However, we have tested and recommend this Excalibur dehydrator uh, link in the video description. Once filament has been dried for at least 48 hours at a temperature between 45 and 50 degrees Celsius, take it out of the dehydrator and place it in your Nautilus box immediately. Filament left out for even an hour can absorb enough moisture to cause print degradation. To load filament into your Nautilus box, start by unscrewing the cap and sliding the lid out from underneath the lip at the bottom of the box. Take your filament and poke the end of the filament through the filament feed hole located at the front of the Nautilus box. Make sure that some filament is coming out the end at the exterior of the box. Place the filament spool in the Nautilus box, being careful not to let any of the material come off the spool as you do so. Now, take two desiccant packs and place them in the bottom corners of the Nautilus box. Then take your lid, slide it back under the lip at the base of the box, and screw the cap on securely. It may take a few minutes for the hygrometer on your Nautilus box to read the correct humidity. Be patient. You can refresh your desiccant packs by placing them in the dehydrator for at least 48 hours. The desiccant packs included with the Nautilus box are color changing and will turn from orange to dark green when they are near their moisture absorption capacity. You can also use and refresh the desiccant packs included with your filament. You can now place your Nautilus box on the spool holder of your Nautilus and print directly from it. There are notches at the bottom of the Nautilus box that mate perfectly with your Nautilus's spool holder. Alternatively, you can secure the end of the filament in the hole located at the bottom and place it in storage. Once the hygrometer on the Nautilus box reads a humidity percentage of above 30%, it's time to take the filament and desiccant out and dry them again for at least 48 hours. The humidity in the Nautilus box will stay below 30% for a varying amount of time depending on your environment and how dry the filament and desiccant were when you placed them inside. When fully dry at our facility, we typically get two weeks of storage below 30% humidity before drying is needed again. All right, that concludes our introduction to the Nautilus filament dry box. The Nautilus box is available for purchase now on the Hydra Research website. Thanks for watching.